Decks can help you understand and visualize your network and see who knows who and also find the right person. To get started, open up the Network tab in your web or desktop application. Here you can see the first network view, which is the groups view. In the groups view, you can see the groups that you've created as well as the contacts that belong to each group. By left-clicking a contact here, you can see a quick preview of that contact on the left. Because a contact can belong to more than one group, we'll actually also highlight the contact in each of the groups that it's part of in blue. If I left-click the group here, I can also add one or more contacts to that group. Here, if I add three contacts to the group, I can see that change reflected immediately. And if I were to add another group for a specific contact, you can see that change here as well. Finally, you can right-click a contact to open up that contact directly. You can press the Escape key to close out. And you can also right-click a group to open up that group directly. If you have a lot of groups or contacts, you'll be able to scroll this list, and this list is also searchable. The next thing I want to show you is the related network view. Here on the top left, you can see a toggle that toggles the related view. If you click that, you'll be able to see all the contacts that you've added into DEX, as well as their contact relations, or who's related to whom. After this view loads, you'll be able to see links of who is sent as related contact to whom. If you click a contact with your left click, you'll again see that same preview, and you can actually add new contact relations here as well. So here, if I add in a new contact relation, you'll be able to see that that contact has been added with a new link drawn. This view is most likely more useful if opening a specific group. To do that, you can use the group selector here, pick a very specific group, and then just see contacts in that group. Now that you see only contacts for a specific group, you can also drag and drop to create a contact relation. Here, if I see that these two contacts are related, I can drag and drop one contact onto another. You'll see an orange outline, and that will create a new contact relation, which you'll see in this preview here as well. This way, you can kind of create your graph of who's related to whom, either in a specific group or for all your contacts in total. If you'd like to add more contacts to this group, you can use this link over here, which will allow you to add one or more contacts to this specific group. And as before, if you right-click a specific contact, you'll also be able to open up that contact directly and see their information in full context here. I hope this video was useful for you as you understand what you can do by visualizing your network with DEX. Thanks for watching.